Tom had a pretty big crash on Wednesday training. His spine is hurt. His rib cage is hurt. But breathing is difficult. Anyway, he's sorting his own wounds out. So Thursday, Tom had a rest, and then Friday, meeting up for lunch at the bike club to then set off to some, I don't know, big velodrome competition this weekend. Tom doesn't do great at the velodrome, but he's happy to be part of the team. It is a massive long drive to get there, and there's traffic jams another 20 minutes up the road. 20 minutes of traffic jam, it's pretty normal, this one. And the next one says 53 minutes. Obviously people are going to try and avoid it. So I decided to go completely cross country through the Ardèche. And get off the auto route, get away from the auto route. And go completely far out. Come off the motorway, we have around 140 kilometers to go. So, yeah, 140 kilometers of countryside roads. Go, go, GPS. Four hours so far, and the whole drive took me four hours and 30 minutes flying along non stop. Get to the velodrome, and it's nice, not too steep. 400 meter lap. Let's see how long it takes for me to lap a velodrome. It's going to rain this weekend and I'm not going to be able to ride so I thought I'd just do a few laps on Friday afternoon while I was waiting for the others to turn up because I was separated from the convoy or it all got separated up anyway. So let's see my 400 meters Synthetian velodrome lap giving it full beans and 35 seconds for a flying lap let's see from a standing start Kind of weird that all the velodromes are different lengths, especially these old outdoor ones. This one is 400 meters and it's extremely flat. The other ones are steeper because sometimes they'd have like a motorbike in front called a derny and the speeds get very high. This one's going to be much better for the children to race on. Anyway, almost around to 400 meters. I'm going to quickly look up what the 400 meter running record is. And the 400 meter running record is 43 seconds. So, wow, great job, me on a bike. Finally, the riders turned up after their eight hour epic voyage. And they are staying somewhere else altogether. And they are racing this weekend, Saturday and Sunday. <laughs> 